Respect the drip, Karen. Hello everyone, it's JD here. We are in the car at the car wash and I haven't done an intro from a car wash in quite a long time. Uh, and that normally means that something good's about to happen. We are off for a small cruise. I've just washed my car. I'm going by myself, just cruising around because it's still illegal to cruise with 10 people at the moment. But there is some news on that. So I'm gonna find a spot, I'm gonna stop around and I'm gonna explain basically what was announced today. Here we are at my just chill location. We are right near the airport and I just uh, lost all of the... <laughs> I'm actually in heaven. Okay, there we go. And yeah, I just thought I'd park here, just create an update video, and then I'm going to do some photography while I'm here. I don't know if I'm allowed to be in this spot, but I just want to utilize the time that I have before I get kicked out. Anyway, there is a special update. Today it was announced that tomorrow night, we will be allowed to go out in 10 people groups without being in like two separate households. This means that we can practically go on 10 car cruises. And that means that the car scene can start popping back up. We probably won't have events, but I do know that Highway will probably try and come back and there will be a lot of cops there. So that's a thing, but there is no re four reasons to leave home, which means that if I was outside in an area where a lot of people are and I'm not attending as a part of the group, then they can't legally book me unless I'm actually doing something wrong. If I'm wearing a mask, if I'm socially distancing, it should be fine. Also, because things are going so well, um, it can also mean that next week or the week after that, uh, we should be seeing that regional Victoria will be opened up meaning we can go on cruises up to Lawn and Apollo Bay again. I can go to visit my friends in Geelong. I can go and do some awesome cross-country stuff. And then, fingers crossed, if at that same time the borders between New South Wales and Victoria are also uh, legally allowed to be crossed, then, fingers crossed, I will be able to go up to Sydney or something, maybe bring the skyline, or I might just try and work out another arrangement, but that is for the future. For now, it's a big day. I'm going to celebrate it. I also picked up a Boss Coffee. This is the vanilla that I was trying to hunt before. So that's also a part of the update. You can find this at most 7-Elevens, Coles, uh, Coles Express, not the normal Coles. Some of them don't have it. Some of the Woolworths supermarkets have it. Uh, but apart from that, 7-Eleven is the best bet. They tend to have everything Japanese as well, so pretty good. Anyway, I'm going to utilize the sunset and the time to take some photos, and then after that, we're going to go and find a place to chill. What a great place to chill. I literally had about 10 minutes or so uninterrupted photo time. Got to chill, do some YouTubing, and now... I'm kind of considering going up to Daniel's Donuts. Of course, I am running a bit low on fuel. And the reason is, the prices have hiked literally overnight. Now I gotta look for and find a cheap petrol station, which is hard to do these days. But I'm thinking either Daniel's Donuts or maybe just a chill cruise somewhere. I'll figure it out. Anyway, let's head out. Let's go and do something fun, and yeah, I'll take you guys along with me. I just have to stop and appreciate the weather. The sky is a nice blue. I'm just so appreciative right now. It's also super windy. You probably didn't get most of what I said because it's super windy, <laughs> and I tried my best, I'm sorry. Microphones just don't do that thing, especially on mobiles. <laughs> so, yeah, I just decided to stop. The weather's really good. I don't have my GoPro on me, so you guys won't get to see some sunset driving, unfortunately. But this is one of two videos this week. I will be doing another video later in the week, so fingers crossed that that all goes well. Anyway, 
let's get onto the petrol station because I use like a lot of my petrol doing the uh, photo shoots down in the industrial park. So yeah, let's just uh, let's just get onto it. <laughs> Alas, we have made it to the Daniel's Donuts car park. Oh, not bad. It's Ford, the V8 Ford as well. I think it's an LTD. That is actually mad. Oh, some more boys are rolling in. It's literally so quiet, which is so unusual. I mean, it is a Monday, so it kind of makes sense why it's so quiet, but at least the highway is allowed. I can hear a bike, or is that a bike? Yep, it's a bike. Where is it? Oh, there it is. I think it's rolling in. Yeah, it is. Here we go. Oh, that was a really nice sounding bike. Good exhaust too. I got myself a pie after all. Also, I just realized I have my flash on. It's cold as, and I don't want to crumb my car, so I'm just gonna sit over here by super cheap, <laughs> eating my pie. So the lighting is starting to get terrible, so I'm gonna have to make this quick. This video is basically updating you guys on everything that's happened today and upcoming stuff that's happening in the future. Anyways, be sure that you have that bell icon clicked because there will be a video out this week. Hopefully it will be at highway. If not, I'll just come up with something to do which is small and not too risky. Uh, but tonight, I think things are probably gonna be kicking off, but unfortunately I'm leaving. That's kind of sad. I should have just went here later and, um, and watched all the cars balling down the highway. But oh well. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, be sure to click that like button. Click subscribe because there will be plenty of amazing content as lockdown is easing in Victoria. That's pretty much all. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.